In a significant discovery, NASA's rover Perseverance has acquired data affirming the presence of ancient lake sediments in a massive basin on Mars known as Jezero Crater. The study, published on Friday, January 26, reveals findings from ground-penetrating radar observations conducted by the Robotic rover. The observations support earlier orbital imagery and data reinforcing scientists' theories that parts of Mars was once submerged in water, raising the possibility of past microbial life. Conducted by teams from the University of California at Los Angeles, UCLA, and the University of Oslo, the research, published in the journal Science Advances, utilized subsurface scans captured by the car-sized rover Perseverance. Over several months in 2022, the rover transversed the Martian surface, moving from the crater floor to an adjacent area featuring braided, sedimentary-like formations resembling Earth's river deltas when viewed from the orbit. Utilizing soundings from the rover's RIMFAX radar instrument, scientists gain insight into the Martian subsurface obtaining a cross-sectional perspective of rock layers extending 65 feet, that is about 20 meters deep. Described by UCLA planetary scientist David Page as akin to looking at a road cut, these layers present clear evidence of soil sediments carried by water and deposited at Jezero crater and its delta, mirroring the processes observed in Earth's lakes. The findings solidify Earth's hypothesis, suggesting that Mars, now cold and arid, was once warm, wet, and potentially habitable. Looking ahead, Scientists eagerly anticipate a detailed examination of Jezero sediments believed to have originated around 3 billion years ago through samples collected by Perseverance and future transport to Earth. This latest study serves as a reassuring validation, affirming that scientists embarked on their geobiological mass mission in the right location. The surprising discovery of volcanic rock in early core samples near Perseverance's landing site, initially expected to be sedimentary, does not contradict the recent findings. Even the volcanic rocks exhibited signs of alternation due to water exposure, suggesting that sedimentary deposits may have eroded that time. The RIMFAX radar readings disclosed evidence of erosion both before and after the formation of sedimentary layers at the crater's western edge, unveiling a complex geological history. UCLA planetary scientist David Page expressed the positive development, emphasizing the significance of now encountering evidence of lake sediments on the delta, aligning with their primary objectives for selecting this location. It's a promising chapter in the ongoing exploration of Mars.